make a movie of it. You dump it, then we'll do it. I gotta make a movie of it. I'm here with Olga, who is an actress from Russia, and she's known online as Olga K. Hi. Hey, guys. Hi. So how did you get into YouTube? Oh, gosh. Well, um, I came from Russia, and I came here with the circus, and I was juggling. Yeah. And uh, so I was doing so many things, and I, I thought I felt like I have so much more to my talent. So I discovered YouTube, and I thought, well, that's a great place to put my videos out there. And I put up some juggling videos, and then I said to myself, I have to learn how to edit and create some sketch content. And mm -hmm. you know, show my talent <laughs> even more. So, and I've been doing that for three years. How many videos have you made? I've made over 170 videos. When you're responsible for your entire production, including you know costume changes, editing, and then promoting the stuff you actually make, how do you manage all of that? If I'm not editing, filming, or doing anything else, um, I do promoting. Like you said, I have a lot of social networks, Facebook, Twitter, and I consider that part of my job. And there's one other thing that I do. I thank every single person on YouTube that subscribes to me personally. Really? I go to their page and I leave a comment saying thank you for subscribing. From wow. Russia with love, and it takes a long time. <laughs> what do you call your fans? I call my fans Mooshers. <laughs> Hello, Moosh Army. Today, we're going to talk about the meaning of Moosh. People always ask me, what does Moosh mean? Okay, so I have a phrase, a phrase <laughs> word, and it's Moosh, and it goes like this. Moosh! <laughs> with a sweet face like this. I have a cat Mushka, and I call her Mush Mush all the time as a short for Mushka. This guy, a sexy Mike on Block TV, he said, "Why don't we just call our fans Mushers?" Mm -hmm. And we, then we use Mush to replace all the other words, like I like Mush potatoes. Oh, I Mush <laughs> you so much. That's so cute. So we use Mush for everything. What other opportunities has your exposure online brought to you? Oh, a lot. And one of the main things that I've been part of for the last nine months is um, uh, working with Ford for Fiesta Movement. Mm -hmm. And uh, it started nine months ago when they were looking for 100 people uh, to promote the new car that is coming out in June of this year uh, called Ford Fiesta. So they use this social media uh, people to promote the car. Do you think that partnerships like that help legitimize people who are online personalities? And this year in particular, I see so many changes mm -hmm. uh, where companies do respond YouTubers and their viewership and their power online and their message that they can you know deliver to so many people around the world and you see more companies using YouTubers you know to promote that now that we've talked about everything that you do can you show me where you film I would love to let's go Okay, so this is my studio. Uh, this is my prop bed. Yes. Uh, and obviously it's pink because it's better that way. And I have prop curtains because um, they're fun. And this is my really cool wall. This mm -hmm. is all this art is sent by uh, my mushers. And in each video, I say thank you to them. And I put it on my wall. And each week, I change it. We haven't seen you really juggle yet. Do you think we can go and you can maybe teach me? Of course. Are you ready? I'm not bothered to be ready. Okay, let's do it. One, two, three, and then stop. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> One, two. <laughs> So I think I'm going to leave the juggling up to you. Okay. But thank you for talking to us today. Thank you for stopping by. That was a lot of fun. You can check out Olga's videos at youtube.com slash Olga K.